Jack Peart has left a lasting legacy in the Grand Rapids boys hockey program. The defenseman won Mr. Hockey in the state of Minnesota this past year and is now expected to hear his name called this weekend in the NHL draft. But even as Peart is set to become the 11th Thunderhawk drafted in the NHL, he still has time to give back to his hometown. A Grand Rapids squirt coach during the week and a hopeful NHL drafted player by the weekend. Jack Peart has always dreamed of getting drafted by an NHL team, and that dream is expected to become a reality this weekend. It's definitely been crazy. Um, I never thought I'd be talking to NHL scouts or um, higher up office guys in, in the NHL, and um, just for that to happen this year has definitely been crazy for me. And I mean, I feel it's just every kid's dream as soon as they put on skates and um, watch an NHL hockey game. That's what you want to do. The two-way defenseman skating and poise on the ice are strengths that catch scouts' eyes, but maybe Peart's greatest strength is just how well he knows the game. I feel like my, my just my hockey IQ helps me a lot playing the game. Um, I feel like uh, I can think the game pretty well, and um, I feel like that's one of the biggest things that separates me from others. A lot of that hockey IQ comes from years of watching former Grand Rapids teams, as Jack's dad Todd was a Thunderhawk coach for 10 years. That's a big reason why Peart returned to play for his high school team this past year and why he continues to give back to Grand Rapids hockey. High school guys, when, when you're a, a squirter, a mite, they're your heroes. And um, yeah, just to come back this year and, and help those guys out and kind of grow the program a little bit and it's meant the world to me just to kind of walk around the rink and, and see how happy people are just to see me. That's why I've loved growing up here in Grand Rapids. It's been really special for me. Peart will be watching the draft with his family in Michigan. He's expected to go anywhere from the late in the first round to the third round and he said he'll be happy with whatever NHL team selects him but also that it would be cool if his hometown or home state team, the Minnesota Wild, drafted him. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.